Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Katie. Thank you for stopping by. I hope you like being here. I like having you here. I really do. I enjoy it. <laughs> um, so, if you're new, my name is Katie. As we've established, what we haven't established is what I do here. Not generally. Here, I open subscription box stuff. So, skincare, makeup, stationery, and then also some other things, you know, sprinkled in. It's keeping it loose, keeping it goose. <laughs> I don't know what that means, but today we have Sticky Club for January 2021, first of the year. This is the vintage pack, it says it on the back, which I like. Because sometimes I forget, you can choose between, if you're unfamiliar with Sticky, Vintage, Cute, and Pop. What does that mean? What is Sticky Club? Sticky Club is a sticker subscription. It is $10 a month plus a dollar shipping in the US and then a little bit more international. They send it in an envelope. There's no tracking number. I love that about it. You get like six-ish sheets of stickers plus usually a few other items. You also get an organizer as you'll see. This is one of my favorite subscriptions. As I said, there's cute pop and vintage. So there are different themes each month. And as I also said, you can choose between them each month. They give you spoilers and you go in and you pick which one sounds interesting. So it's a great way to kind of Brighten up your life and not lock yourself down, but get a fun surprise every month. It's a good one. This is a good one. I got the vintage this month. Uh, there was cute, which I was tempted by because it was Pusheen the cat. So it was exclusive, which is great. But um, I don't know. I vibed with this way more this month. I do switch it up a lot. I'm not consistent with what I get. I used to be a cute diehard, but they pulled me in in November with one. It's just so... Whew. Now I'm all over the place, which is nice. Like I said, we're loose, we're goose. All right, so let's open her up and uh, take a look. So as I said, you get an organizer, which is an A5 size for an A5 binder, six ring, which is great because then you get to keep all your stickers together and get a leaf through them. All right, let's take a look. And what I also like, let me get everything out of the organizer. What I also like is they send you little theme stickers to put on the corner of your organizer. So as you can see, the vintage theme for this month is Sunday afternoon. So you get to stick it right in the corner, and then as you leaf through, you can see what theme it is. Right? Right. So I like to start with the non-sticker items. We have, first, this little notepad that says luncheons and teas with some gold foil. I often find myself saying metallic word than foil with the subscription just to give you an idea of what's going on lots of metallic foils and they're always so good oh, so here we go not too thick which i like because you get one of these about every month so if they were too thick it'd be too much i think it's a, the perfect number it's cute just got little shoes but nice and then the other non-sticker item is a little hard to get up Embroidered umbrella patch, also metallic. So cute, and it's stick-on, so you can just whack it on somewhere. And it's got some sticky on the back, which is great. I don't know if you could sew it onto fabric. Probably could. I don't know, experimenting? Let me know if you've sewn little stick-on patches on. But isn't that cute? This is a size like that. Nice. All right, off to a great start. Already excited for my Sunday afternoon of luncheon and teas. Oh, oh, and then there's other stuff. Oh, it was hidden. There's more. There's more non-sticker items. There are two postcards. Oh, these are beautiful and they're so nice. They're very nice quality. This is Good Afternoon. So nice. Great color scheme. People eating. Classic postcard back. And then the other one is <laughs> I love this. Busy. So nice, beautiful, absolutely wonderful. I didn't know I was getting these. Itchy nose. Um, wonderful. I'm very. Why am I so excited about these? I don't know because the holiday season. You're writing holiday cards. You're writing thank yous. This, that. You're mailing stuff. I mailed a lot of crap this year, so I'm just like mailed out. But some. This is nice. This is pared down. All I gotta write is one sentence and then send it off, and someone has this beautiful image to look at, and that's the gift. I like that. Just explained postcards to you. In case you weren't aware of the appeal of a postcard. Alright, now we're on to the stickers. 
eat off to an even better start. All right, first up, we've got from Jessica Vu Illustration. That's her social media information if you're interested in this artwork. That's another thing I like about Sticky Club. They often partner with art other artists and bring them on so they have their own stickers and then also outside stickers. And it's like you're kind of supporting small artists a little bit too, which I really, really enjoy. And I usually end up following these people on Instagram too, so I get introduced to new art. Love it. Love it. But these are very cute. Got some gold foiling here, as I said. I'm saying the word foil a lot. Nice little picnic basket in the container. Some pie, some envelopes, some tea, some flowers, a little French press. Great. Love it. Next up, we've got some washi tape style stickers, which always end up being a favorite, but I never know how to use them. If you guys have a, oh, this is what I use these for, use, let me know. This is Sticky Club in-house, as you can see, matches the theme of the postcards and the other non-sticker items we got, which is also great. You usually get some stuff that's a theme, but not everything's that theme exactly. It's like mix and match. So you're not overwhelmed, but you get the idea. But these are great. Like I said, they're washi tape kind of texture, so they're a little rougher, a little papery. I like it. Next up, we've got some nice semi-transparent, I don't know if you can tell on camera, basket stickers. And one of my favorite things about this subscription is there's ample opportunity to pick a favorite. You can pick a favorite sticker from each sheet and then a favorite sheet. And right now, uh, this one, I'm loving. Isn't that a cool basket? Where would I get something like that? I don't know, but I want it. And this is what, next up, this is what drew me in. This is what and got me to pick vintage. Artist stickers. And this is what got me last time to stray from cute. Is I really enjoy these rectangular snapshots from paintings. You got a few famous ones in here. You got a few. Maybe if you're really into impressionism you, you know about them. But maybe if you're not, they're introductions. Beautiful. And they're just, I mean it's art that's been established as aesthetically pleasing and been put into museums, although that's not the criteria, I don't think, for most museums, but it's, it counts for something. And you got it kind of in a nice little sticker form, and I really enjoy that. I love these, and I love the shapes. I love those long shapes. Nice. Next up, these are cute. These would be something I would stick on the back of an envelope. This is that type of sticker for me. We've got these nice black and white matte people on bicycles. So cute. So cute. All the fancy outfits. Love it. We, uh, I think in November, got ice skaters that were similar to this, and I've been using those to seal envelopes as well. Love them. So good. Ooh, next up. These are some of my favorite types of stickers. Last month we got coffee beans that were similar, but they're kind of resiny, 3D, they've got like jelly stickers almost, of perfume bottles. Aren't these just so pretty? Do you see the glitter in there? You see the glitter? Oh my gosh. Watch one of these as a favorite. Which one? Oh, it's hard. I think, ah, uh, uh, the pressure. Why am I putting this pressure on myself? I think this little guy, this little guy right there. I just like the pattern on it. Is that a favorite for me? Let me know. Yeah, that little guy. Solidified. Decided. Moving on. Um, and then final, final sheet. We've got these society ladies in beautiful gowns. Fancy dogs. Nice hats. What's this? What's this? What's she doing? She's picking out her gloves. Look how many she has to choose from. It's more gloves than I own. As, as I was saying that, I don't know if that's true. I have a lot of gloves, actually. None are opera length, though, which it appears all of these are. Maybe not opera length. I said that like I knew what it was, and then I don't. Okay, so that's our sticker sheets. Let's go over what we've got here. We've got four non-sticker items. Little notepad. Sticky embroidered emblem. Two 
absolutely gorge postcards. What's your favorite one of these? Mine's the postcards by far just because of how surprised I was by them. And then for the stickers we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven sticker sheets, which is a good number. Sometimes it's only six. Um, wait, that wasn't even the end of it, was it? Did we get here? Yeah, we did. We did. Long day. Um, wonderful. Let me know what you thought. What's your favorite sticker sheet? Mine is definitely the perfume because look how pretty and this is my favorite perfume. Let me know if yours is different. I'd be interested to hear why because I'm obviously right. No, 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 no. That's not my attitude generally, except all the time. Um, all right, that's a great one. As I said, this is one of my favorite subscriptions because it's just so lighthearted, so fun. There's no tracking anxiety. It's great. Um, let me know what you thought. If you enjoyed this video, you can give it a like if you feel like it. Subscribe again if you want. No pressure. And uh, thanks for stopping by. If you are interested in more stuff, I post on Sundays and Wednesdays. So check back then if you want. If you're interested in my eye look today, I posted a video where I talked about the Allure December Box Ciate London Trend Edit palette and did a little quick eye look. So this information is available for you if you want it. Um, that's the last time I'll plug that video, I promise, because this is the last video I'm filming with this makeup on. Um, so, if, and if you want to also check out my Instagram, that's down below. Link's down below. You know how it is. There will be info. Check it out if you feel like it. It's free. Free information. Relatively correct information. That's rare nowadays. Um, yeah, check it out. Thank you for being here. I appreciate it. I hope you have a good day. I'll see you around.